Let's go over how to set up Remote Play for PS5. That way you guys have a proper workaround so you can still utilize your Chrono Zen while you're playing any online video games. Now if you guys are unaware, recently there was an update and a patch with the PS5 January 24th. This update effectively blocks the use of a Chrono Zen, but no worries, we do have a workaround. This video will go over the workaround today, so let's get started. First thing we gotta do is go into your PS5 and look for System under the Settings menu. After that, click on System, go to Remote Play, and then from Remote Play, you're looking for Enable Remote Play. Click that over so that it is enabled. After that, go to Power Saving Mode, or Power Saving, sorry. It's still under System. From there, make sure all of these are clicked on to the right. From here, we want to go to Accessories. So go back, Settings, Accessories. And then underneath Controllers, what we're looking for is this right here. Communication Method, Utilize Your USB Cable, not Bluetooth. Now, we need a computer for the next part. But before you can utilize Chrono Zen Studio Apps, we need to download Remote Play for PS5. Here's what you're looking for. So go to Google, PS Remote Play. And then you're going to find a link similar to this. Hit the download button. And then after that, you're going to get a little installation link. Looks like this on your desktop. Click on the link, double click it, hit OK for whatever language you prefer. At that point, you're going to extract everything. And then from there, you're going to install it. Right after you hit install, you're going to get the whole, you know, installing remote play. And then just click, uh, you know, hit finish and make sure you launch remote play as well. Now, here's what we're looking at next after Remote Play is launched. This is still on your PC. Pick which one you are, PS4, PS5. And then we already did all this. So this is what we did in the beginning of the video. So you don't have to worry about this, but you can redo this again if you feel like you want to do that. Okay. So hit OK. It'll find everything. Check your internet. It'll, it'll connect. And then boom, you can see this little thing right there that says it was connected using Remote Play. Now we go into Zen Studios. So I like to hook up both cables, hook up your small USB cable and your right-sided USB cable, and then from there, click on Zen Studios to open it. Once you click on Zen Studios and open it and both cables are connected, you have your Zen Studios app running. What we're gonna do from here is we're gonna go into our studio app right there, we're gonna go to device, go down to enable PS Remote Play. Click on that. And again, the little thing there says if it's not finding the device to click find device, but it did find it, so we're good to go. And then after that, that's it. Just make sure those two settings are set up and now take your Zen and go have fun. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comment section down below. I love all you guys. And remember, keep it Zen out there.